prayed with you. I request that that song be sung at my wedding and yesterday. In a couple of uh, months to come. I was almost losing when she was singing. That's a good song. Um, before I say anything, I would like to just uh, bring apologies from our president, um, who couldn't be with us today, Mr. Emmanuel Bobiko. However, he did ambush me. I'm here today to say just uh, a few words. A guest of honor, um, I worship the mayor of Kitwe, uh, in Pasamaya, represented by the town clerk. A special guest, uh, Minister of Youth, Sports and Arts, uh, Minister, Honorable Elvis Inkandu, represented by the permanent secretary. Uh, Vision Zambia Executive, Director Namutula Sindila. Um, the authors, Lillian Chipeso, kept at another one, Memory Chanda. Uh, business executives, colleagues in the media, family, young people, friends, may I simply say distinguished guests, guests ladies and gentlemen. Today, our Lillian Chipeso and Memory H. Chanda launch a book entitled The Power of Self-Embrace, which is being brought to the world's attention and the plight of hundreds of millions of anxious people and youths world over. One might ask why the power of self-embrace? What does the author mean? Well, we are all here and eager to learn more about this lunch. There is an old idea that says, if you want to hide information from an African, put it in a book. However, this saying is non-existent anymore, as most of us, if not all, have now opened up our minds through exposure and are able to read and understand what is going on world over. One would also wish to pose a few questions uh, to the author, such as, what would be the purpose of this book launch? Is it to get sales at bookstore? We've already been warned, so we should be serious. Uh, to get sales online, to grow the author's list, to raise money for a charity, to encourage people to take specific actions. Well, we are here and yet to hear from you. Nevertheless, as a chamber, we would like to take this opportunity to congratulate the author of this book for writing the book at such a young age. And we can only wish that some of us, too, started writing books at your age, as we would have written more than 20 books by now. I'm therefore wishing and urging you uh, to teach us how to write books. I'm one of your students or candidates for that. Further, it would be nice of you to also write a book about Kikyo and District Chamber of Commerce and Industry. Uh, when you reach a stage, please indicate that. Kikyo and District Chamber of Commerce and Industry is an independent, non-political, uh, subscription-based subscription -based association dedicated to promoting friendly business environment with members drawn from every sector of the economy and range from independent entrepreneurs to the right co large corporates. Further step that the Kitwe Chamber is a key player in the promotion and facilitation of um, uh, intra, local and international trade. Uh, some of the activities of the Chamber would include, but not limited to awarding companies that have excelled in various categories of business at various at our own prestigious uh, Gala Award. Uh, and that we hold interactive business meetings, liaising with stakeholders on pertinent matters for business growth. We also wish to urge you to write a book about Kitwe District, starting from the time before independence, time during UNIP era, the time during MMD era, the time during PF era, and also the time during the UPND era. That's a quite a mouthful. <laughs> because we need to be reading uh, fact issues unlike fiction. To enable the future gener that is to enable the future generation um, to have an insightful idea um, of what Kitwe was and how it will be up to the time they grow up. Lastly, but not the least, would like to thank you 
for inviting the President of the Kituan District Chamber of Commerce and Industry to be one of the participants during this launch. We just want to thank you most sincerely and hope that we'll sell more books before even we leave this place. I thank you for this.